Umbrian is good for you. I mean, Umbrian in OU, I don't know, man. It doesn't compare to Blissey and um, Gensi. Because it's gonna get 2 hit killed by King Tran the Rain. It doesn't touch Hydreigon. Gengar is still running Focus Blast. Doesn't have access to Stealth Rock. I really don't know. Like, Umbrain is a cool mod. I used it when Boko 1 was new. Were, at that time, Blissey was just brain dead. So easy to play Blissey. <laughs> yeah, I will keep the stream short, I think. Still need to recover. <clears throat> like, it's been such a long while since I have um, didn't go to work because of uh, <laughs> being sick. Feeling sick. What do we have here? This guy is bringing the UU team. It's not we do have... Uh, this guy. Mm. Oh, there's the gold bet. Ooh, rank five, boys! Finally, finally, a good opponent. I'm gonna trick this. Even though I'm getting the black sludge, uh, I need to make this guy useless. What did he give me? Oh, Eevee light. <laughs> yeah. He's basically useless now. <laughs> Hitting him up, the Hydro. I'm not gonna do it to him. I mean, getting off this damage is beautiful. He took it so well, though. He took it really well. He was, he's playing with fire, but he's making these risky plays, man. I assume this guy has knockoff or something. Um, it'd be the stealth rocker of his team. I think it's actually gonna be the defogger. All bet using toxic. So, how am I gonna deal with this? I'm gonna pivot into bliss. <laughs> Could have killed him with Hydro, but I really wanted to catch the other guy. Nice Beamer. But U turn damage is not gonna do anything to me. Yeah. 
yeah, you know, I can always freeze this guy, so. <laughs> I'm re get caught in it! I mean, I'm clicking it for a reason, right? Yo, Jonathan, what's up, man? Love you too, bro. I'm pivoting to kiss. Oh, he really wants to unfreeze this guy. Wow. <laughs> he was really trying it. Could have, could have even killed him here. Like, multiple opportunities. He's playing really risky. But I'll heal bell my Rotom. Leftovers. The Renatar. That's for Pursuit. Not decent. Doesn't do too much to me anyway. Good killed her! I think Ligar has um He forfeits <laughs> Ah he, <laughs> he knew he knew he was screwed from that moment. Like uh, it's bulk up con Kelder. Um Gligar doesn't do anything to me. Uh, since he's using Taunt, uh, since he's using U-Turn, so I basically set up versus Gligar. Like, like I win there for, with Bulk Up. Because Golbat doesn't have the Eevee Light anymore, so I knock him out with Rock Blast. But, uh, what was his team again? Um, of, of course, I kill Empoleon. I kill Tyranitar. What else did he have? And like I said, Gligar, I set up on Gligar. I would have bulk up, up I, I destroy Mian Chao. I can instantly lose this to uh, Kunkelder because his Golbat doesn't have the Eevee Light anymore. I'm not streaming on YouTube. <laughs> but one more win, guys. One more win and we get 700. Don't know where that will put us. We're playing versus Rain. Uh, Kabutov such a big threat, such a big threat. Yeah, I'm gonna lead off with Rodomir. <clears throat> he leads up with Ferrothorn. Uh. Oh, what can I do here? Ideally, he's gonna set up Steldrucker or something. It's giving this to Joy Scarf is really nice. Just for power whip, uh, it's not ideal. It's fine. Locked into power whip. I'm gonna go into high dragon there. I have leftovers, so let's crew there. <clears throat> you can just freely go for Dragon Pulse. Because if, if he keeps clicking up Power Whip, it doesn't matter. And him go and just hitting the Pelipper. Oh, I don't think this kills. But it should get some nice damage on him. Just click it again. Joy Scarf. I should not die though. There we go. That's his rain setter gone. That's his rain setter gone. Next time I get in Hip Bowden. It'll be good for us. I can actually go Hip Bowden here. 
No, High Dragon should outspeed the majority, uh, except from Starmie. Joy Scarf, Pelipper though. Okay, that's Joy's band. Scissor. Goes into Kingdra. However. Lissy should completely wall this now. Because he doesn't have rain. Expect him to go into one of his steel types. He decides to forfeit. And that's 700 boys. That is 700. I'm just so surprised that he was willing to give up his Pelipper like that. Because with Pelipper gone, suddenly his team is less scary. <clears throat> the reason I didn't go for Nasty Plot. Um, the reason I didn't go for Nasty Plot against uh, Baratorn was that reason. Because if I go Nasty Plot and he goes into Pelipper, he gets up the rain. And then my flamethrower on one of his steel types would be less effective if he pivots into that. Because it wasn't likely that he was going into scissor there. But any anything would have been hit nicely with the uh, with the with the dragon pulse. Yeah, we had 700. Not sure what where that takes us. Oh, this is not fun to face. This hyper offense. <clears throat> He's gonna leave with Garch almost likely, setting up the stealth rock. Hate facing this. <laughs> A lot of people use this team, but I just hate facing hyper offense. Just playing it is so straightforward. But if I click Discharge and uh, Poison Breloom, that would be nice. Uh, Paralyzed Breloom. If I don't get it, then... It's, okay, it's whatever. Unfortunately, I don't get it. I'm gonna go for Defog. Because he's gonna look to spore me. Move it into Togekiss. Togekiss. That does so much damage. Crazy. Is he the what type of guy that does this again? Step bro? Um, it's nothing. Just going for the air slash there. Mm. Be better for me. Oh wait, this is Joy's Bandit. Fuck! Fuck. I, like, I know this team! <laughs> That sucks. I, knew th I know this team! This is not good.
Yeah, man. Like I know the team. <laughs> I know, I know. I would live regular Dragon Claw there. He was choice banned. It would be really easy for me to click Flame Tower here. Still gonna do it, even if he switches. I have Stealth Rock up. He doesn't. So he does get the damage off of me. Spore sub bunch. This is what's his last attack going to be? Umbrella. He should Ice Beam first, and then when I go Blissey, he can rap choose to Rapid Spin. His leftovers? They're typically Life Orb. Since he showed sub focus punch, I'm actually not afraid of staying in there. Because he will never get it. He can never click focus uh, focus punch if I just keep attacking here. Because I'm pretty sure you don't run drain punch next to it. So otherwise you just get completely well by a ghost type. Theoretically, we can still win this. Okay, I don't remember if this guy has... Uh, he, he saw my Toxic. But there is a big chance that this guy has... Um, Aveguard, so... <clears throat> okay, uh, this is also fine for me. Like, Rotom is already asleep. You only cash. What's up, man? Rotom is already asleep. I can only always freely attack. Does he have Hurricane on this? Would be strange. Oh, I got rid of full Corona. Please connect the Rock Blast. All I need you to do is hit, man. He crits me. Please hit. Wait, I only hit two times. Are you freaking kidding me, dude? That's so lame, because he crit, he crit and got the special attack boost. He crit and got the special attack boost. Man. This is so unfair. He wasn't, he isn't safeguard though.
But Galdor would have been so nice too. You better not be one of those rest sets. But I really think Blissey just beats him. Because he will never be able to get off a focus punch against me. We just keep salt boiling. Like, that was the unluckiest event ever, because... I, he crit me, he got the special attack boost, and I only got two hits. He does show Seed Bomb. It actually does a lot of damage, holy. Yeah, Ice Beam at 70. He went for, he went for sub there, holy shit. Got him here, though. <clears throat> Guard jump is choice scarfed. Checking my dragon in case he goes for Draco. Now Hip Bowden should live the attack. I'm gonna slack off now. That way I can take on Dragon Knight. And I only need Blissey plus Hip Bowden to win this. I can pivot back into Blissey. That's for a rapid spin, that's fine. Like, the speed doesn't matter, he outspeeds my team naturally, so... for Ice Beam in case he went into one of his dragons there. But Garchomp doesn't have the Life Orb. And like I said, Hippowden should be able to wall Dragon Knight. Is he's Choice Bandit? Oh, the only way is if he crits me. I think he has to go for it. He has to go for the crit. He doesn't do it though. Hmm. 
<laughs> yeah, I just go back into Blissey again. And we just click soft wheel. I can actually go for Rodomir. But also stay in. Like, he can never kill me. Because he's choice carved. But I can use a turn to actually try to wake up. Because <clears throat> Rodom is still faster than Dragonite. And he's immune to Earthquake, too. And now it doesn't even matter if I lose Hippowden. Because Blissey will take on Garch and plus Blissey. Uh, plus Starmie. So we managed to win this game as well. And <laughs> yeah, man, how could I forget about... The dragon not being banded. Like, I faced that team so many times, guys. I faced that team so many times. Oh. I haven't checked the leaderboard. <laughs> we are actually really close to top 100. <laughs> Didn't mean to go for it. Hey, but whatever works, works, right? 